Once upon a time, nestled along the beautiful Niger Delta in Nigeria, flourished a proud and industrious people known as the Kalabari. Their history is a tapestry woven with tales of resilience, trade, and cultural richness. Centuries ago, in the 12th century to be precise, the kingdom of Kalabari emerged as a beacon of power and influence. The early Kalabari people, led by their visionary leaders, settled along the fertile riverbanks and lush mangrove forests, harnessing the abundant resources bestowed upon their land. As the years passed, the kingdom of Kalabari grew into a vibrant maritime state. The Kalabari people, renowned for their mastery of trade, established prosperous connections with neighboring communities and European traders. Dates such as the late 15th century marked the beginning of European contact, as Portuguese explorers and traders arrived on their shores, opening new avenues for commerce. Within the kingdom's borders, the Kalabari people were organized into several city-states, each with its own unique traditions and customs. They were led by wise and powerful rulers known as the Amayanabo. The Amayanabo held not only political authority, but also served as custodians of the Kalabari culture and heritage. One such influential ruler was King Amakri I, who reigned during the 17th century. His visionary leadership and diplomatic skills strengthened the kingdom, fostering peaceful relations with neighboring city-states and expanding trade networks. Under his reign, the kingdom of Kalabari prospered, attracting merchants from near and far to its bustling markets. In the 19th century, the Kalabari people faced the winds of change as the British Empire sought to exert control over the region. The Kalabari rulers, like King William Dapa Pepel, navigated the complexities of colonialism, engaging in diplomatic negotiations while endeavoring to protect their people's interests. The Kalabari people's rich cultural heritage flourished alongside their political and economic pursuits. They celebrated vibrant festivals such as the Ekine Sekiapu and the Owu Festival, showcasing their artistic prowess, traditional dances, and masquerades that mesmerized all who witnessed them. With the passage of time, the Kalabari people adapted to modern developments, embracing education and actively participating in Nigeria's struggle for independence. Many Kalabari individuals have left indelible marks in various fields, including politics, academia, and the arts, further enriching the legacy of their people. Today, the Kalabari people continue to honor their ancestors and preserve their cultural identity. Their history serves as a reminder of their resilience, their contributions to regional trade and politics, and their commitment to keeping the flame of Kalabari heritage alive for generations to come.